channel. I hope you had a great new year and a great Christmas. Today I'm going to be showing you a room tour because it's the new year. So my room hasn't really changed that much but last year I did really change my room so I thought it was a good idea to show you what it looks like. Remember to like this video, comment down below any ideas that any videos that you want to see and I need them so please comment them. Subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell and yeah let's get straight onto the video. So welcome, this is the start of my room. My door is right here. As you enter my room, you come to, as I call it, the pop vinyl shelf slash the marble shelf. Because, as you can see, we've got a lot of pop vinyls here. We've got a lot of range. We've got some Black Panther ones here. We've got some Elton John ones. I call it the Tower and pile because it's Elton John and it's Egg Z with good old JB there. And then we've got some Spider-Man ones and then just some like Guardians ones, some Captain Marvel ones, stuff like that. And then behind it we have this like Captain America Civil War kind of like, I don't know what it is actually, but it's, it's Captain America Civil War. And then up here we have like this um, Captain America the First Avenger um, collection of basically film, and I'm pretty sure it's genuine as well. So it's like little shots that were on film of the movie. Here, here we come to our next shelf. Got another pop vinyl here. We have Agent Coulson and Load of the Car. So here I got this like Elton John record, which is a phone holder. And then behind it, one of my friends got me this. And if you don't know, uh, well, you do know, I'm really into music. And she got the letter B, and then she just put a load of like buttons on it, and then she got a musical note on it as well. And then over here, we have a plant. This is just a fake decorative plant. And then behind, we have Blue from Jurassic World on a pop vinyl. And the next shelf, we have another fake plant, because gotta love these fake plants. And then behind, I have this figurine of Storm from X-Men, and I'm pretty sure my nan and granddad got it when they were over in Spain, so that's cool. Then when I went to Bournemouth, if you saw, I got these two figurines. So one's of a dolphin, it's in blue, and then it transitions into pink and white. And then I got a turtle, which is like a tortoise or a turtle. I don't really know the difference, but yeah, I got one of them in kind of like a marbly kind of color in yellow. And then again in my Christmas haul, I got these, these lip balms. And then my mum was going to give this to one of my friends, and it was a picture of the Deathly Hollows in like this um, black frame, but I kind of liked it myself, so I was like, can I keep it? And she was like, yeah. So that's from Amazon. And then I have another plant over here, it's another fake plant. But yeah, here's like the entrance to my room. Then down here is my Blu-ray shelf, and on top of my Blu-ray shelf I just have my little jewellery kind of box. And then yeah, I just keep all my jewellery in here, like earrings, necklaces, bracelets, stuff like that. And then down here is what I call the Blu-ray rack. And um, basically it's got all the Blu-rays in it. And on here I basically got Play That Tune, which is basically a bunch of kazoos I think it is or something. You have to play the tune that's on the card, which is fun. And on here, then here I've got the Ultimate Family Quiz, which I got from m &S. I'm pretty sure that's from m &S too, to Play That Tune. And then down here, as you saw in my Christmas haul, I got charades. And yeah, basically this is my little Blu-ray rack. So welcome, as I call, to the study area, which is my desk. And again, I apologise for the lighting. First off, we have my laptop right here. And this is just like a HP laptop, I think. Mouse, and then I plug it in all the time. And then back here, I have a lava lamp. And then I have a little light up sign called Light Up My Life. And then on top of here, I have a Spider-Man figurine, a Kylo Ren figurine, which you saw in my Christmas haul, and this little thing that I got when I was on a school trip, and it just says I love spec savers on it, which is British um, opticians, which is like where you get glasses checked out. And yeah, it was just a little like, as me and my friends call it, a floof. It's a little like fluffy kind of thing with googly eyes on it. So yeah, I'm a bit weird about that. As we move over from my desk, um, behind here, behind my laptop, I've just got two packs of highlighters and then my Nintendo 3DS, which I haven't played on in ages and now I'm gonna play on it. A box of tissues because it's winter, you know, it's just a bit sniffly here and there. And then I have this little sign where you can change the day and the month. And here's my phone. My phone is an iPhone SE and I basically just bring it with me anywhere that I can. And then here's my reusable water bottle. Again, I take this, I put this anywhere that I can. And then here I've just got a bunch of basic 
I'd say like sticky notes, but like they're rose gold around the edges and they're white on top. And then I've got flashcards because always need them, GCSE year, constantly needing them. And then I've got more sticky notes, um, sticky notes that I've been written on, and then more sticky notes and another sticky note that's been written on of maths topics. Then behind my bottle I just keep two rulers, one metal, one plastic. And then here's my little stationery pile which I have here. It's basically just like pens, glue, rubbers, scissors, Muji pens, lots of different types of like stationery that I'll need every day. And then here I just keep a hole punch because hole punches are always helpful again for revision. And then here I just keep my iPad, my earphones, my headphones, and then behind my fake AirPods. And I also keep, um, again, a phone holder. And then this is my radio that my mum managed to win, which is really nice. And here I've got four sets of basically like, I'd say like filing kind of things. And yeah, it's just filled with magazines and lots of schoolwork again, which is not a surprise. So down underneath my desk, um, here poking out the corner is my um, electric amp, which I used to on my guitar and ukulele, which we'll see later. And under here I've got my tripod case and my laptop case for whenever I take it about. Here, if you saw, um, from the I got a record player. So here underneath my desk is where I keep my records. And then here is all the folders for school that I need, so like English, maths, geography, stuff like that. Then behind here is just where I keep all my bath and shower things, so like um, shower lotions, bath bombs, like body scrubs, stuff like that. And yeah, that's what's underneath my desk. And over here I've just got like my little TV area. So I just have an LG TV and then I keep controllers and I keep my, um, my shampoo bar just here as well. And then I have a Blu-ray player because I like watching lots of movies, so that's helpful. Then, which I also haven't played on in a long time, is just the original Wii. Everyone loves the game console Wii, like that's basically my childhood, I don't know whether it's yours, but yeah. Then here I also keep my power bank and my glasses because um, my eyesight's not that great. And then I just have this little Spider-Man figurine. And then when I was ill, my mum went to the shop and she got me, I was really like craving smoothies, just like loads and loads of just like um, smoothies. So they all came with this like little Christmas hat on. So you'll see later, I just randomly put, put the Christmas hat on things. So yeah, just a Spider-Man, this is actually a money box, but I just used it for decoration with this weird hat on. Then down here, I just keep some of my shoes. So underneath here, I've just got some like trainer pumps and then I've got normal pumps and then I have the new high heel boots that you saw in my Christmas haul and some blue adidas shoes. So then down here in this little squeeze space that I've just about managed to fit in, I have my bedside table. So here I just keep the book I'm currently reading, so I'm currently reading P.S. I Still Love You and I'm trying to get it done before it comes out on Netflix. And then in there I've got the bookmark, the Queen bookmark that I showed in my Christmas haul. Then I've got one of the watches that I showed in my Christmas haul. And I also have this little like reading lamp, I would say. So basically you just like switch on and it's just like a little light. And yeah, I just use it when like I like to read at night. And then here I just have a vitamin, vitamin E lip balm. And then here is what I like to call like my secret stash of food. So I have some Starburst, which my friend got me for Christmas. And then I got this like little reindeer bag and I basically just stuffed all the food I could in it. So yeah, that's fun. And then I just have my alarm clock and I use this for school every day. Also down next to where I was just sitting, I have my new record player that I got for Christmas and tucked behind the bedside table just there is the Niffler I also got for Christmas. So here is obviously the biggest bit of my room, which is my bed. So I just get, I think my bedding from Amazon and then I have one um, bluey gray cushion and one white cushion which I've actually flipped over because of the butterfly on the other side then this pink heart cushion and I have a silk pillow and then just a normal pillow that matches the bedding by here I've also just um, I put a nail in the wall and then I blue tacked up some fairy lights and then up here I use a app called Fonto which is basically it makes your photos into Polaroids so I've just printed out loads of Polaroids um, I just stuck them on my wall so there's 16 here then over here I just have more photos that I just found on Google and I put them all to the same size in Word, I think it was, and again there's 16 images here, 
But here, as you can see, hello, is my mirror. And then down here, I just have loads and loads of slippers. And then to try and tidy some of the mess up behind here, I've just got some more boots. And up on this wall, just behind my mirror, I've got this thing where it says, and I've pinned it up and it says, only when we're lost can we find ourselves again, which I thought was really cute. And so over here is, of course, my bookcase. So my bookcase is quite varied. So on the top of my bookcase, I have a picture of me and Hope. You know who Hope is, she's been on my channel. And then I've got, basically what I do is I do this weird thing is I collect different figurines, any kind of zoo or aquarium that I go to, I have to pick up, buy something that is from the zoo or aquarium. So here I just have a bunch of figurines. Then behind here is basically kind of like my makeup brushes and some of my skincare. So first off I have a mirror. Then on the front here I have a little spray. And then I have a perfume. I know my unpopular opinions, I did say I don't like perfume, but like I'm, I do use it sometimes. Like I'm gonna be honest, I use it very little. And then here I have another like perfume, but this one is not like a spray on. And then I have the Sleepy Body Lotion from Lush. Then on here I have a Jack Wills English Velvet Body Butter. And here I have a cleansing balm. Then it's just all my skincare and yeah, it's just Mario Badescu, just kind of like hand creams, eye creams, makeup remover. And then behind the mirror I have some makeup brushes and here we actually come on to the real bookcase so my bookcase is quite varied so on this first shelf it's kind of like where it's all at so under here is just my hard drive and then I have Girl Online by Zoe Sugg, Girl Online Going Solo by Zoe Sugg and I have my bullet journal I have like this thing and my poem got featured in it so there's just that underneath here a spare bullet journal for whenever I want it and Girl Online on tour by Zoe Sugg and that's signed i'm not going to go through all the books but i was just explaining the ones that you can't really see if you want a bookshelf tour make sure to like this video and i'll definitely do that and yeah on here i've basically just got a bunch of fantastic beasts and harry potter figurines so like snake some of them are pop vinyls so like harry and dumbledore and newt are pop vinyls then i've got some other figurines like ron um fleur snake stuff like that and here i've got this little box and basically if you take a listen If you don't recognise that, that's the Harry Potter theme tune. Then on the second two shelves down here, um, first off I keep, this is where I keep most of my camera equipment, and then over here is where I keep the rest of my camera equipment, so I just have the microphone bit and then the box to the actual camera that I use. Then I have this little thing that I won from the school and it's called a speaker and it's very cute. And then obviously for Christmas I told you about the light up candles the electronic light up candles and i was like i don't know how to use them and i figured it out and i've only actually managed to like sort out one so far and then over here i've just got a ukulele cap and then just some guitar picks and then down here as you saw me organizing in my last video was this little space with all my schoolwork. and here i just put two candles next to it you can't really see one but you can see this one and then here i've got stephen king's it and that's really like the only big book that I've got down here and then the rest I just kind of like sticker albums like the bigger books like um got like you name Evie like Cassidy's book Tiny Birds like Christmas books and stuff like that and then down here I got a little message in a bottle I can't remember what it says but that's cool a little Buddha and then I've got this thing called a worry stone um I can obviously tell that my mum wrote this out but it's cool anyway and yeah, that's my little bookshelf. If you want a more in-depth bookshelf tour, remember to like this video. Then over here is what I like to call my little music space. So I have my guitar, and it's just a three-quarter guitar, and I put the cap on it. Here I have a normal ukulele, and then I have a electric ukulele. And then on here, just to, if you're wondering what this is, this is my prom dress, and then here's my wardrobe, but you've seen my wardrobe probably about 10,000 times on this channel, so I'm not gonna show you it. And here we kind of make my way to the last bit of my room. So here I just have a DVD rack and yeah, just loads of great films on here, TV shows. And then down here is my school bag. And then up here I keep all of the chargers, like my Nintendo charger, iPhone chargers, like USBs, things like that. And yeah, that's like kind of the last bit of my room. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this room tour and maybe you want to see a new room tour in the future, 
or another type of video like this, remember to hit the like button, comment down below any videos you want to see, subscribe to the channel and click the bell. And I will see you next time. Bye.